Today is Sunday, May 29th, and today in our devotional, it says, A Grateful Heart. Psalm chapter 28, verse 7. The Lord is my strength and shield. I trust him with all my heart. He helps me, and my heart is filled with joy. I burst out in songs of thanksgiving. Psalm chapter 95, verse 2. Let us come before him with thanksgiving and extol him with music and song. Psalm chapter 100 verse 4. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful to him and bless his name. Psalm chapter 118 verse 21. I thank you for answering my prayers and giving me victory. 1 Chronicles chapter 29, verse 11 through 13. Yours, Lord, is the greatness and the power and the glory and the majesty and the splendor for everything in heaven and earth is yours. Yours, Lord, is the kingdom. You are ex extolled as head over all. Wealth and honor come from you. You are the ruler of all things. In your hands are strength and power to exalt and give strength to all. Now, our God, we give you thanks and praise your glorious name. Psalm chapter 7, verse 17. I will give to the Lord the thanks due to his righteousness, and I will sing praise to the name of the Lord, the Most High. And at the bottom, it says, from a young age, mothers teach their kids manners to be polite and say please and thank you. Interesting that when it comes to God, we use the word please a lot more than thank you. We are dis disgraduated and angry when God provides differently to our plea than we had asked for. An example includes, please help, Lord, my boss is furious with me, instead of thank you, Lord, that I have a job. There are many things that you can thank God for today. Count your blessings, not your sorrows. And I like that this morning because I am I'm very, very grateful for the things that God give me. And I uh, I, I know I've said it before, but we we should look at the better side to the things, just like just like that said. Instead of uh, instead of what what he said about the job. Let's see. It says, "Please help, Lord. My boss is furious with me." Instead of complaining to God about your job, be thankful you have a job. Many people don't have jobs um, for different reasons. But uh, instead of complaining, instead of complaining, saying, Lord, all I have is beans to eat today. Be thank you, Lord, for these beans that I have to eat today so that I don't go hungry or so that my family is not hungry today. You know, uh, me personally, <laughs> I've had rough spots. I, I have, I, I have, um, with <laughs> when my kids were smaller and, uh, my poor kids had to eat beans for a week. But I thank God for them beans. And my kids didn't go hungry that week. So, <laughs> but, you know, instead of complaining about the things that we have, you know, it, it could be, well, I don't want these beans. I want a steak, you know. Thank God that you have them, you know. May not always be what you want, but he will always, always provide your needs always just trust him
no matter what you're going through. That was just a, that was a situation that I went through years ago. <laughs> and God seen me through it. He seen me through it, you know. But kids weren't too happy, but <laughs> they didn't go hungry either. So, <laughs> but I love you guys very much. Uh, as always, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Like, share, and subscribe. Join me on the Disciple server. The link is down in the description box. Uh, there, I do three uh, group studies a week um, on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, Tracy does a Bible study on Sundays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. And Jess does a Bible study on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. We also do communion. Jess does communion on Saturdays. So join us on there. Something going on every day of the week. So uh, we have other rooms. There's You can get caught up on the news. Uh, there's dreams and visions. If you want to check out dreams that other people's had that may relate to something that you, you've experienced or something that uh, a dream that you've had, you know, join us on there. Lots of things going on. But I love you guys, and I still have company. I will have company until the third, or second or third. I'm not sure what day they'll be going back. But I am grateful to spend this time with my parents. <laughs> but I love you guys. And I'll, if I don't see you in the next video, I hope to see you in heaven. Bye, guys.